We want to show you some surprising new videos which revealed that a woman in the passenger seat is at greater risk than a man in a car crash. Believe it or not, this is the first time the government is using female crash test dummies. ABC's Cecilia Vega has the newsmaking results. This is the new female crash test dummy. She's 4 foot 11, significantly smaller than her male counterpart. And this dummy is teaching us something startling. Women run a greater risk of being hurt in frontal and side crashes. Take a look at these 2012 Toyota Sienna crash tests. The male dummy is in the driver's seat. When the car hits the wall, you see him lunge forward to meet the airbag, which deflates, burying his face and absorbing the impact. But look at the female dummy on the passenger side. Remember, she is smaller and her seat is closer to the airbag. So the airbag ends up hitting her and does not deflate, pushing her head down, snapping her neck back. Watch it again keeping in mind that a woman's neck is generally less muscular than a man's, so the threat of injury is greater. For the smaller, lighter woman, you need a better design of the seat itself. Now car companies are required to give not just an overall safety rating, but a specific one for women in the front passenger seat. And the results? Cars like the 2012 Toyota Venza SUV and the Acura TL four-door got high marks for male drivers, but under the new safety ratings, they received just two stars for female passengers. Toyota said the new ratings do not mean the vehicles are less safe. The safety ratings are at safercars.gov. The hope? These new female dummies make all drivers smarter and safer. Cecilia Vega, ABC News, Los Angeles.